It goes with the territory. We always expect the sparks to fly when these two clubs cross paths. Two teams who represent an unbridled commitment to excellence. Stay with us for all the action live from Anfield. It's Liverpool against Manchester City. Good evening. They might have done quite a bit of refurbishment work on this stadium in recent seasons, but it still has a refreshingly old-fashioned quality about it. We're at Anfield. My name is Derek Ray, excited to be bringing you match commentary. And alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Liverpool facing Manchester City. Well, both teams know they need to start the game well here, try to dominate the midfield area and get their creative players on the ball. This should be an interesting game, I think. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting 11. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Ibrahima Konate in central defence. And playing up front today is Mohamed Salah. And so they starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson gets the nod in goal. John Stones plays alongside Ruben Dias in central defence. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Ilkay Gundogan in central midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. And they kick off here. Will it happen for them? Jota. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Foden. Holland. On to Silva. And reading it absolutely superbly. And that will be the goalkeeper's ball. Alexis McAllister. Well, he's certainly not alone. Well, a decent position for Liverpool to be in. And teammates to play it to. The danger not over. Well, they can bring it out now. Well, Liverpool have started brightly. Some of their play has been really good. They're unlucky not to have the lead here. But it should boost their confidence. But they can't afford to drop their guard at the other end. They're not testing the keeper at all with that effort. in the middle really well positioned Diaz And Diaz has it. And he takes on the shot. A strong 
glove on the ball from the keeper. Well, it's always a great thrill to watch Erling Haaland in action. He can be absolutely unstoppable, and we should expect that he'll have a prominent role to play in this one, Stuart. Well, he's been in fine form in the league, as you can see from those stats, and it's going to be a real test for that back line to keep him quiet. If they switch off, even for a minute, they'll be punished. He's blocked it! So, Bosloy... Averted. Luis Diaz. Well, over power, but it didn't work out for him. As you can see, Liverpool have had all the ball in the last 15 minutes and have played some really lovely football going forward. They must now make it count and get themselves in front. Now can they win back possession and create something else? Walker. De Bruyne now. Foden. It's a promising City move. Foden. And not hitting it with the accuracy he was hoping for. Well, he took a chance there, and he probably regrets it now. That was the wrong decision. McAllister. So, Bosloy. Chance for Liverpool to use Wid to good effect. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Walker. Now Holland. Bernardo Silva. Well, conceding the throw in. Good challenge. Well, his throw in radar was a bit off. He'll try his luck here. Well, I'll tell you what, surprising everyone by taking on the shot from that range. Yeah, that was certainly a good effort from that sort of distance. Really struck it cleanly. Andrew Robertson. Diaz. Options in the centre. And it goes! The opening goal in this contest! Well, here it is again, and I don't expect keepers to save everything at their near post, but I think he should probably do better. He'll be a little bit disappointed with that. City get things going again and the onus is on them to erase the damage done by that concession Holland here's Grealish 
Gvardiol. And Diaz has it. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. He's in here. Oh, oh my God, and grabs another one. Two goals in quick succession. Now they have the lead. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. And that brings to an end the first half here at Anfield. Well, part of the story here, Erling Haaland struggling to make an impact. And how often do we say that? He just hasn't been able to affect the game so far. He hasn't had too much of the ball, but even when he has, he's not looked threatening. The ball rolling again, and the first half struggles of City were there for all to see. Can they put up a better fist of it in this half? Stones, Grealish, Holland, and return to Grealish, Foden, could get themselves back into it, oh and the flag goes up, well he needs to be more aware there, he didn't work hard enough to stay on side. Salah. Salah. Oh, breezing past him. And the keeper there to deal with it. Just a quick reminder, we have more action from the Premier League coming your way. It's Liverpool taking on Newcastle United. Neat passing, confidence on the ball. Salah. It's looking promising. The cross is on. Well, no danger now. was needed I really thought they were going to open up the defense Grealish Gvardiol well it clearly was deflected so it will be their throw in well we always enjoy bringing you live action on EA TV and Premier League action coming up it's Manchester City facing Nottingham Forest Good tackle. Gundogan. Now a potentially dangerous position for City. Gvardiol. And return to Grealish. The City corner it is. And no foul on the referee's opinion. They have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And the short option preferred. 
element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Holland, and there is the goal! Well, that changes the equation, and they have the momentum now. Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place, and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? Federico Chiesa. And this is Diogo Jota now. Good ball over the top. Liverpool couldn't keep it. Grealish. Gvardiol. Good weight on that pass. Now to take it away. And a tidy ball. Options in the middle. Foden. A City free kick for Cunning. Corner for City. Can they find an equaliser? And he didn't miss by all that much with the header. Just a little bit off target. Federico Chiesa. Perfect tackle. This might be ideal for the counter. Still trying to make something happen. Intense pressure. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. And Liverpool regaining possession here. What can they do from here? Options in the centre. And it leaves the door ajar. Well, I think that would have secured the victory. It's a real waste there. <laughs> Ruben Dias. Grealish Diaz Walker now Bernardo Silva Foden It's with Gundogan Phil Foden And now Stones Foden Chasing this game, Manchester City with time running out. This could level it, and you've got to credit that magnificent piece of defending. Well, that was the chance that City have been looking for, but they've just been denied by a very good save. It's been a frustrating day for them. Free kick awarded to Liverpool. Well, he must proceed with great care. Could easily have been cautioned. Chance to cross. Jota. He's got to have a go here. What a magical save it was. Well, they'll be looking to add to their advantage from this corner. Going short into the box oh that might have sealed it for them well he has to make the keeper work there that's a bad miss Walker 
On the ball, Ruben Diaz. De Bruyne. Phil Foden now. And that is all for this game anyway. It goes into the books as a victory for Liverpool. Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserve the result in the end. Well, Luis Diaz really wired in. He deserves all the credit going, I think. Well, he scored a good goal. He hit the woodwork and was a constant threat. So overall, he should be really pleased with his display today.